Hey gamers, by request, here is some sneaky and fast loot. This POI, this green modular with the roof there, is called the dollhouse. We used to call it the greenhouse greenhouse because it's green and there's a greenhouse in there. Steal their mail, go through their vehicle, and run around back. Main loot's up there. All we gotta do is get on the roof. Don't have to chop through anything, just get up on the roof. There might be somebody on the beam there to fight. If you go up the other side, there's a bird. And they can probably get to you, but it's going to take them a while to do that. So just take what you can. There, I think that's pretty much it, unless they're hiding something from me. But that's another POI that's real easy to go through. Let's just take a look at what we got. Just that little quick raid. We got a level 2 pipe machine gun, which we're taking, trading for that one. We got a few books, we got some food, we got a fortifying grip mod, and a few basics. Gee, the Hesnas. Hesnas residence, the one with the car in the kitchen? It's possible. Grab your frames and get up to that vent. You're gonna have to take the windowsill too, if you want to go in there, and we do. Here's your main loot. You got your ammo pile, leather trunk. Savage Country Box, Med Pile, you don't want to walk there, that stuff collapses, and there's three zombies down in that room, and no way out. It will not end well for you. Alright, this is what we got. We got a little bit of ammo, a level 4 primitive bow, books, a little bit of food, and yet more recog, we're taking the bow. Alright, that's not a bad haul for a little bit of work. I've broken my leg in this POI so many times, the Powell Residence. They have a workbench. If you run around the other side, don't oh, steal their mail. If you run around the other side here and get up there, see him? All right. Now you all you gotta do is jump on over, and there's your main loot. Nice. Low effort. High reward. Let's go see what we were able to steal from them. All right, we got a book. That one is Brass from Doors. We got some cat food. We have a, we found the Fortitude mod. Three armor parts. Robotics parts. Not bad. Not bad for no effort. This was a POI introduced in Alpha 20, I believe. It is the vet. Animal hospital. You can get a lot of stuff out here without getting, you know, in a fight. But there are dogs to fight if you go in the back there. But you can get potatoes. Great place to come for potatoes. And you can get the main loot too. You can go up from the side. I like going up from the back. Just because the zombies that do trigger do trigger from the side. I'll show you. Make yourself a bridge, walk across, hop up on this chest. The zombies are down there and they'll spawn in there and they have a pass to come up here. So if you start coming up from the side, you're closer to them, you might wake them up. That's why I like coming at the at them from the back. It is a tier 2 POI, crack a book crate, and a savage country crate. It's an easy, quick, very quick raid. Don't even have to fight. This is what we got. We got some ammo, some books, some knuckles, some schematics, four grip mod, which we're going to keep, some first aid, more recog. This game is really throwing the recog and the steroids at us. Let's put that on there. Give that little pea shooter a little bit more damage. I think we did pretty good there. The goldsmith residence. Now the goldsmith residence, you got to fight for the main loot, but there is an unguarded crate and box in here. Just break this thing down. There's your box. There's your toolbox. There's a working stiff crate. Today it's a working stiff. It does change. We got an acid. There's another box. Lots of good stuff in there. And another box yet. Check the shelves. Check the cupboards. And that is a good little raid. Let's take a look at what we got there. Okay, we got a couple of vehicle books. We got a battery bank, an acid, a duct tape, some gas, more repair kits. We got a lot of good stuff out of there. Just that little quick garage raid. That's the goldsmiths. The Williams Residence. This POI has been around for a long time. And one thing it always has is in this garage back here. There's... I've never seen anybody in here. Never. But there's a workbench. And there are two crates up in the rafters. So we got a passing gas crate for some repair kits. And we got a poppin' pills crate for some useful things. You got the workbench. Sometimes you can search that car. There's cupboards. These kind of cupboards can hold cooking pots, so check them every time, even if they're in a garage. See, we got a grill out of that one, right? Check the garbage. You never know what you're going to find in garbage. I found some epic things in garbage. Check the bin. 
All right, if you're feeling brave and lucky, what else you can do is come around here, the front of the house, make yourself some frames. Probably don't need 77 of them, but give me 30. See that window up there? We're gonna try to get up there. All right, that looks like main loot to me. Grab your crate, level three pipe shotgun, and a book. What else is in there? Passing gas crate. Vehicle book and some oil. That's a thousand hit points. If you want to hammer away at the sides, go for it and go around and see what else is in there. There should be an ammo pile, maybe a med pile. There's the med pile for some good stuff. Maybe the ammo pile's on this side? Yep. All right. Let's take a look at what we got here. All right, we got the level three pipe shotgun. We got some more books, a little bit of food, some parts, some good stuff. Two repair kits. I love the repair kits. We got a grill, vitamins, and it gave us a shovel and some recog. That's a pretty good haul for no fighting. That is the Williams residence. Easy, easy stuff to get. Smithstone silos. You can grab the end loot without a fight and check this truck in the meantime. Gonna need a lot of frames. The side with the semi-truck, not the side with the work trailer, but the side with the semi-truck, you're gonna want to get up there. 16 frames. Crawl over onto the top of the silo, break the window, and push the button. It opens up the hatch behind you, and that's where your main loot is. And there's actually nobody down here guarding it, so let's see what we get. It's a level 2 POI. Oh, level 4 pipe rifle, crack a book crate, and a shamway crate. That is that. You can poke your head in and take that trash. Steal the chair. If you have a wrench, you can grab the street light on the way down, too. Fun fact about this POI is uh, this pile of sand represents grain, and there's always a couple of chickens. If you're quiet, you can sneak up on them and grab them. See, there's one. There'd always be two chickens, a bunch of corn out there. I guess that is supposed to be corn, whatever. The chickens eat it, and you can get chickens there. Let's take a look at what we got. Okay, little tier two POI, little smash and grab, not a bad haul. We got some hobo stew, some gas. We got a level four pipe rifle, some ammo for it, a few books. We got a bandolier mod, which I'm stealing, and some food, water, gunpowder, painkillers. Not a bad haul for a little bit of work. So that's... Shit. We are not set up to fight coyotes. We don't even have a firearm. 